Greetings gamers, Bio here, and today we are playing Hollow Knight. Now to be absolutely honest with you, I have zero experience with this game and it was requested by our friend Frank Underwood. So who's here with us? It's uh, Stuart Flesher. Panayotis, the Smurf, Frank, Vasilis, George, and Tris. Welcome, guys. Let me know if you can see me okay. Let me know if you can hear me okay. <laughs> Dimitris, hello. Carlos, hello. Our friend, Frank. Sorry about that. For the longest time I thought that Hollow Knight was about kind of a cute ghost, but apparently it's mostly tied to bugs. <laughs> Very interesting. So, Frank Underwood, our patron of the arts for tonight, do you have to anything to say? Anything to add? Anything to share with the people watching us? Of course you don't need to go AAA to make good games, man. Signalis exists. Asterigos exists. Okay, my glasses need some polish. They need to say curve. Polish, you know? They need to rust B. Thank you, Frank. Oh, that's sweet, Panayotis. Okay, so let's thank our friend Frank for making this stream possible. You know, I want to bring you stuff that you want to watch, but it has to be a viable process. This community focus streams make it so i can stream whatever you want whilst also you know making it uh, sustainable so right trigger is dash quick cast i can remap stuff right so i won't be Okay. That's what I want. I want B to be on this paddle. Stefano, hello, hello. Welcome, my man. Hope the fam is okay. <clears throat> okay, do we need to watch for anything here? Also, guys, I'm running this in pristine 4K 120Hz. You'll be getting 1080p 60, but the better the, the base quality, the better the stream will look. So, Frank, yeah, I'm playing on PC. Salavandra! <laughs> He's asking if I've used Vaseline for the... Butt hurt. Okay, guys, I have no idea what I am doing. Very first run. I'm gonna lower the sound a tiny tad. So I won't have to scream like an idiot because I do it on reflex. And I hope you have something to drink because soon enough the whiskey will start flowing. Welcome to Hello Night, peeps. Let's go. <coughs> Thank you. 
In walls beyond they speak your name with reverence and regret. For none could tame our savage souls, yet you the challenge met. Under palest watch you thought we changed, base instincts were redeemed, a world you gave to bug and beast as they had never dreamed. From Elegy of Hollow Nest by Momonon the Teacher. Okay. Yeah, the music already hits hits the right spot, I have to say. Let's hope I will uh, leave this session with my mind intact. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be challenging. I love the feedback, Demetrius. Let's hope it'll be the same for me. Here we go! Oh, this is very responsive. Kabani! Thank you, Tube, for the generous donation. Thank you so much. A game by Team Cherry. Extremely responsive controls. Love you too, my man. <laughs> Salamandra, why did you go to Horny Prison? Yeah, Silk Song is almost upon us. Oh, shit! I was looking at the chat for half a second there. Oh, we have a hit counter. We don't have a health bar. Okay. Okay, all I can see is what I illuminate with my presence. Okay. Party! <laughs> Thank you! Excellent, Arty. You can chill with us. Bazookas, welcome! Higher beings, these worlds are for you alone. Your great strength marks, your among, marks you among us. Focus your soul and you shall achieve feats of which others can only dream. So we are a higher being. Collect soul by striking enemies. Once enough soul is collected for our trigger to focus soul and heal. Ooh, so your commodity is also your heal. Okay. Hey, Kaburiz. Well, Fire will do his best. We don't get full damage, right? Okay. So there's an entrance here. I'm going completely blind, by the way, guys. Never played it. Have no idea about anything. You're in for a treat. Am I, and I'm in for the hospital. Hey there, beloved Ronik! No fall damage, excellent. 
Spike damage though, I suppose there is. Come here, bug. Yeah, I'm not getting those. Asshole. Okay, so you heal in real time by holding a button, man. It's gonna be a doozy in the bosses. Hmm. What the fuck? Okay. Okay, so it's like Returnal. A little hop when you tap. And a big jump when you hold. So if you don't want to get stuck in ceilings. You need to, you know, just tap it. Sapphire will be here for at least four hours. Depends on the stroke stats, you know. If the stroke is too strong, I'll have to take my meds. Okay, guys, uh, are you getting a pristine picture? Frame rate and everything? Oh. This is temporary health. Let me check the frame rates for one second. Okay, we're not missing a single frame. Excellent. Welcome, people. Glad to have 30 guys and guidettes watching here. Uh, drop us a like if you enjoy the show and have fun. That's how accidents happen. Night of the Hollow. Okay. Ha! Dimitris, thank you. Higher beings, these words are for you alone. Beyond this point, you enter the land of king and creator. Step across this threshold and obey our laws. Well, Frank, Returnal is all, one of my all-time favorites. Vasilis, uh, most Metroidvania games do have a map. Uh, Salamandra, I think two people made this. Okay, Zapfire. Pretty commendable. Ronic, uh, which game did you reach? Dumble Jump GR, welcome. Bear witness to the last and only civilization, the Eternal Kingdom, Hollow Nest. Okay, Colonist builds to last. Man 3 is one of the best, like... Okay... My tiny feet! Plop, 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 plop! It's like listening to Mini run around, like pop, pop, pop. Dirt mouth, the fading town. Okay, guys, question. Do you want me to read out what is being said? Or do you want to just read it? Because my voice can be intrusive. The game is very somber. It has a tone of its own. So, whatever you want. You want me to read, or you want to just read for yourselves? K 
Abu is You will read Read is what you shall do <laughs> Yeah <clears throat> I'll do my best I'll try to read it as somberly as possible Oh there traveler I'm afraid there is only me left to offer welcome Our town's fallen quiet you see The other residents They all disappeared Headed down that well one by one Into the caverns below Used to be there was a great kingdom beneath our town. It's long fell to ruin, yet it still draws folks into its depths. Wealth, glory, enlightenment, that darkness seems to promise all things. I'm sure you two seek your dreams down there. Well, watch out. It's a sickly air that fills the place. Creatures turn mad and travelers are robbed of their memories. Perhaps dreams aren't such great things after all. Okay. Follow the narrator, yeah. <laughs> Read it, sucker. <laughs> yeah, I will. Uh, next thing I will narrate is dating. Okay, so we sit on cute benches and we save. Yep, just realized. For all your mapping supplies, we will be opening soon. Asilda and Cornifer. So these are the mappers and... Well, until they're back, we don't have a map, pretty much. Ah, oh, shit! Thank you, Panagiotis. I appreciate your kind words. Note numero uno, when you change screens, enemies and items respawn. Good for farming, I suppose. Not so good if you keep dying. Guy down there seems a little distraught. Okay. Clean. Um, okay, so people who know the game share the wisdom. Should I go right or down and left? What is the better direction to take here in the beginning so I don't wander around like a doofus? No point breaking more stuff, right? Okay. Temple of the Black Egg. Nah, me know this. Nah, me know this. Means Joe Mama. Hello there. How delightful to meet another traveler on these forgotten roads. You're a short one. But you've a strong look about you. I just hurt myself. I'm Quirrell. I have something of an obsession with uncharted places. This ancient kingdom holds many fascinating mysteries and one of the most intriguing of them is standing right before us. A great stone egg lying on the corpse of an ancient kingdom. And this egg, is it warm? It certainly gives off a unique air. Can it be opened? There are strange marks all over it. I do so love a mystery and who knows what other marvels lie even deeper below us. Oh, okay. Hey, Valerdinos. Okay. So I should talk to them again? Okay. Yeah, yeah. For so long I felt drawn here. So many tales full of wonders and horrors. No longer could I resist. I just had to see it for myself. And what a time I chose to travel. This dead world has sprung to life. The creatures are riled up and the earth rumbles. The air is thick. 
I wonder what could have brought it all about. Man, it must be such a setting. You know, a moist bug nest. To persevere in this ruin, the old nail alone just won't be enough. Though that's no problem, one only has to look around. Plenty have come before us and most have met their grisly end, many more equipped than you and I. I'm sure they wouldn't mind were a fellow explorer to relieve them of their tools. It's a kindness, really. The dead shouldn't be burdened with such things. Okay. Panagdinakos, thank you! Okay, rule of three. Does he have more dialogue? Yes, he does. Did you pass the town above? What a gloomy little place. And such majesty hidden right beneath. I suppose that's why they all headed down here. Who could resist such possibilities? Hmm. Truly marvel, okay. So, this is a no-go. So the game is called Hollow Knight as in Night of the Hollow, which is like the nest, I suppose. Not because he is a shell. Oh, that must be the powered up version. Yep, he has a horn. Man, that's set in music. Hey, James. Okay, Carlos. Oh, okay, so it has some uh, significance. Akis! Excellent, excellent, excellent. What? Oh my! Is this doable without a dodge? Haha, <laughs> I don't wanna try. Oh, it's doable. It's Kaburi is toiling away for the betterment of humanity. That's also his actual voice. I've met the guy, so that's how he sounds. Bury my mother, pale and slight, bury my father with his eyes shut tight, bury my sisters two by two, and then when you're done, let's bury me too. Ha ha ha, do you know that one? It's one of my favorites. We can sing something else if you like. You start singing and I'll join in. I bet you have a beautiful singing voice. Okay, let's sing uh, Wet Ass Pussy. So, what are you down here for? If you come to get wealthy, just look around. These mines are still bursting with riches. There's p p plenty for everyone. Just grab a pick and join in. <laughs> and that's so catchy. See, Kavu, you're exactly this critter right here. Sapphire, you're just pulling my leg. Oh, here zoom! Here zoom! Welcome, man. Thank you for the sub. 
Mwah! Oh, Salamandra Cooking just said I have a sensual voice. Oh, bury the knight with her broken nail. Bury the peppery something about the crown. I c can't remember the rest of that one. <laughs> Maybe I'll just hum it. Man, that's so catchy. How do you find it online? Like a uh, worker's malady. Man, I just suddenly miss Kavuriz for some reason. Whoop! I absorbed lasers. I don't know what that was. This got break, right? Yes, sir. -y. Oh, James is so sweet. And Zoom, I suppose uh, you're a bug in a bug nest going downwards is the thing. Okay. Yeah, yeah, Arty, after uh, playing Blasphemous, I'm all about the hit the wall, hit the random wall. Okay, am I gonna die if I fall here? Oh, it doesn't break. I need an ability or something. Okay, let's go back to Kaburiz. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Hey, Polius! Welcome, welcome, welcome. Except for the uh, Blasphemous games, what other Metroidvanias? I played uh, Trinity Fusion recently, that is an indie, very good. It's more of a Metroidvania roguelike, that one. It's a hybrid. Um. Returnal is kind of a metroidvania roguelike as well. Symphony of the Night for a bit back in the day, but I never finished it. I played a bit of Moonscars, I played a bit of The Last Faith. Okay, I'll try this by the way. Why can't I heal? Oh, that's why. Smurfy, thank you so much. Uh, no, I like Symphony of the Night. I'm gonna tell you what. Let me let me take care of the boss. Did someone say something about a skill issue when it comes to the Phyothosaurus, this motherfucker? No such thing exists. I generally appreciate um, games that deal in exploration, but Metroidvanias for me always feel like I am following a back and forth path, and I'm not the biggest person in repetition. So when I have to retread stuff, I rarely feel it these days. Oh shit. That's cute. Okay. Hello there. Okay, so uh, backwards a bit. 
or below? No, below only goes one way. Okay. Yeah, I know. Double jump is just not hitting it for me. You know what I mean? Vasilis Mostakas, hello. James, that is true. But I appreciate them also as a product of their time. You know, we should play a Team Eco game, we should play Shadow of the Colossus on stream. Cutie's in the wall, okay. Oh, that's the well. We're gonna send. Apart from healing, does gathering these souls do anything else for me? Thank you, Sapphire. Greg, uh, yeah, many people love this one, man. That's the consensus. Okay, this is the path. Okay, that's a try hit. Well, it called it soul. Ooh, here's the collection of the buggeroos. Oh, hey. Thank you, kind sir. Okay, everything's a cutesy in this game. Double jump, I think the Blasphemous series' greatest success is the atmosphere and overarching mythology. Stag, I, I, I don't doubt it. Of the top three favorite indies. First and foremost, the discussion about what an indie is. Uh, this discussion started with Dave the Diver. That had some serious money behind it, so uh, couldn't really be considered an indie. If we're talking indies like tiny teams and self-published, whoa, 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 whoa! Take it easy. That was a that was a big ass drop. One has to be Signalis. I mean, made by two people. I think my most beloved indie of all time is Bleak Faith Forsaken. Made by three people and it's a semi-open world uh, action adventure. Like the scope was insane considering two people made it. Putting so much workload uh, on your head is nigh masochistic but... What I love about those guys... And I hope they don't disappoint me for saying so. They said we have to sell you the game now because we have to make revenue. Or we won't be able to, you know, keep the lights on. And we're gonna fix everything. And uh, they fixed 99% of all the game's issue as time passed. Which is something that is very commendable. Because many times small studios, they kind of get the DAO and they're like, we are out of here. Okay, so we dropped from here. Uh, 
I've gone this way. Okay, I'll go downwards. When you collect all of them, you're in for a disturbing surprise, okay? Dude, triple A is the most bullshit term in the industry right now. Triple A pretty much means that someone uh, dropped a lot of money in the production. That's what triple A stands for. Doesn't stand for quality. Doesn't start for innovation. Once upon a time, AAA games were the games that had enough capital behind them to try new things, to implement new technologies. Nowadays, AAA is just, we threw a lot of money at the screen and the new Assassin's Creed has ray tracing. Enjoy gathering all those bananas. Okay, see if that's good. James, 100% uh, one of the most ambitious games made by a small team. Oh shit, it's Kabanis. It's like Japanese, but bug form. Hmm, hello there. Come down to explore these beautiful old ruins? Don't mind me. I have a fondness for exploring myself. Getting lost and finding your way again is a pleasure like no other. We're exquisitely lucky, you and I. I'm a cartographer by trade and I'm working on mapping this area right now. Would you like to buy a copy of my work so far? Purchase a map of the area? Yes. Okay. View the map, view a detailed map of Hollow Nest and the map pane and the inventory. That sounded Greek. A map can be useful thing, but it alone won't show you where you are. If you're not the head of directions, I suggest purchasing a compass from my wife as Zelda. Oh, that's the mapper. One of the two characters from the shop. Okay. Grim, those are wise words. This is your best friend. A mortal shell was a very contained, honest experience made by a team of about 80 people, man. I'm telling you, Bleak Fate was made by three. One designer, one programmer, and one music composer. They wrote it as well. So, um, there is no comparison, bro. Hey, Kron. Well, those enemies going in circles around the stone formation are pretty Metroid, yeah. See if it's, we heard that as well, yeah. Okay, okay. She's just now opening our new map shop in Dirtmouth, selling all sorts of useful things to wanderers like yourself. She'll even sell some of my old maps from time to time. I pop back to see her whenever I finish mapping an area. She's always so excited mm -hmm. to see me. <laughs> By the way, I haven't introduced myself yet, have I? Yeah, I should apologize for that. When you spend a lot of time by yourself with just your own thoughts, you forget the niceties of conversation. My name is Kornefa, and I've always loved exploring the world. Why, when I was first hatched, I wandered off immediately, leaving my brothers and sisters and poor mother behind. That's why as soon as I could, <clears throat> that's why as soon as I could, a comma is missing here, I moved to Derdma with my wife, a huge unending kingdom to explore right on our doorstep. Who could resist? Anyway, I'll let you return to your troubles. With a little luck, we'll meet again. Be safe and fare thee well. <laughs> Mm-hmm. <laughs>
Well, I'm seldom uh, disheartened by what people call difficult because I know that uh, one person's perception of difficulty is lack of understanding of the methodology. If you are methodical and you plan ahead, some of these uh, unbeatable games are very manageable experiences. There are games that have artificial difficulty, of course, something I don't generally appreciate. Oh, we're in warm territory. I can't get up there, can I? Ah, yes. I guessed as much. Dude! I made for this shit! Ah, Rakis territory. Yeah, uh, hidden jump is is something I suppose will play a huge role in exploration. Oh shit, it's a slimy one. Is this game made in Unreal Engine? Oh, it's one of the little fellas! Yes! Fly, my little one, be free! It's in Unity. Because it has some uh, first time effect stutters, and I was wondering if it's unreal. Leave me alone, Saifulud. Braid uh, is a game I, I love very much. I played a lot of it back in the day on the 360. Oh shit! It's strange how the game does this uh, minute effect. Every time you get hit you hear this frrrr and it stops the sound. Yeah, exactly that. Master Hollow, you survived. Okay. Oh, healing water. Noise. Bonfire! Yeah, we have the poodle here, it's running around. A white ass poodle! Hmm. 
Oh, come on, my man. Falling in spikes gets you to the beginning of the room. Le Cansoa. That was a very blasphemous moment. You're the best. Okay, guys. Uh, part of the enjoyment is the beverages. Cheers to everyone. Thank you for being here. I hope you enjoy. Love you all. Yeah, man, the poodle is part of the of the social aspect of the channel now. It's the cutest dog. The most passive creature on the planet. She just sleeps all day. Doesn't cause any fuss. Sometimes she takes his shit inside. But who doesn't? Right? Right? Okay, I don't think I can reach this yet. some whiskey my brother need a double jumpy here ah! whenever you hit something it uh, pushes you back. That's interesting. Yeah, no, no way. <laughs> Where do I buy Ubisoft stairs? Will I live to see the day that Ubisoft goes bankrupt? Okay. So. Map. Oh, I don't know where I am. Awesome. Hmm. Or do I? To the right it says there are a lot of there's a lot of openings. But are we equipped to reach them? Uh but I got yeah. The difference between Capcom and Ubisoft these days is that Capcom still employs a lot of talent whilst Ubisoft doesn't. Ubisoft pretty much only has time and money for the people who make the cow. So they can milk it. They create the proverbial cow so they can then milk the cow.
<laughs> yeah, I suppose we'll have a charm that helps with navigation. Whoa. Okay, let's go upstairs. Maybe we'll find this guy's wife and she can sell us... Um, It has four directional attacks Up, down, left and right But it doesn't have diagonal attacks Did I go in here? No, I haven't the Pilgrim's Way. Travelers of Hollowness descend through verdant walls and fungal groves to the city at this kingdom's heart. There all wishes shall be granted, all truths revealed. Okay. EA games 100% James. Not because EA produces a slew of amazing games, but because EA still puts money behind some good games like Dead Space Remake was amazing Immortals of Abium by Ascendant Studios the game that recently flopped and the studio pretty much got effed uh, it's a competently put together game with very high production values that doesn't really do anything interesting but you can force me to play 100 hours of Immortals and hardly 5 hours of any recent Assassin's Creed so no man Ubisoft is a no-go. Oh, shit. Why? Why? What did I ever do to you? Yeah, suppose this is a no-go. Is there a way for me to go through his defenses? Yep. That's what I thought. Oh, come on. Okay, we found another of the little fellas. Oh, 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 oh. The excitement. So far, it's excellent. Very good atmosphere. Looks good. Sounds good. Guys, I'm not the kind of person who's gonna look at a game for half an hour and say... Uh, no, or this is the best thing ever, you know, I give them time You can spot a third easily, of course But uh, a real genius takes time There we are <sighs> Papanada Papanada Come to buy a map, Javier It's really my husband you should be dealing with, but what a surprise, he's headed down below He'll pop back occasionally to deliver new maps for the store, but I do wish he'd spend a little more time up here. I've not much interest in retail myself. Now let's see what's here for me to sell. Okay. Oh, that's a lot of stuff. So, Wayward Compass. Highly recommended! If you're having trouble finding your way in the maze of ruins below us, try this charm. 
It will pinpoint your location on the map, incredibly helpful for finding your burnings in unfamiliar situations. Item purchased! Equip a charm to activate its powerful abilities. To equip a charm, open the charms menu while resting at a bench. Okay. <sighs> Papanada. Will, you'll need this if you want to update your map with new areas as you explore. It's essential for anyone serious about mapping. This pins will mark benches and other rest spots on your map. Useful if you're exhausted and just need to find somewhere to sit. Have you seen those beautiful blue cocoons? I made these pins so we can keep track of them. Use these pins to mark shopkeepers and other interesting bugs you find on your travels. Every so often you should pass by and see how they're doing. I designed these pins to keep track of the kingdom's hot springs. Haven't visited any myself, I wonder if Cornifer might take me sometime. I'm sure you'd make better use of these pins till then. These markers are new additions to the shop, you can use them to mark interesting spots on your map. The color is quite soothing, don't you think? Shell marker. These markers are a new addition to the shop, you can use them to mark interesting spots on your map. You could use this color to remind yourself of hard won battles. Okay, so we have a map, a compass, and a way to mark them. Yeah, cat food, welcome. I got it. See if I kind of agree. Nah, man, uh, we, we talked about it in the Greek podcast uh, recently. Some people just want to pass the time. It's a phrase I don't understand. When you say pass, I pass the time, the only scenario in which it makes sense for me is if you're waiting for something to happen and you're just di create a diversion so you don't have to weigh as actively. If you're not waiting for anything to happen and you just fill your days with busy work, you're just waiting to die, man. I don't understand why people like all those time-wasting pieces of shit. Thank you, Artie. A stone door with a simple lock. Yeah, that's one of the reasons. Only also double jump. Don't forget, people nowadays are stupid. I don't want to sound like an asshole, but it is what it is. The amount of messages I get on my vids, man. On my vids... Uh, okay, uh, we need... We need our inventory. What's the inventory button? Oh, that's simple, huh? Hello? While resting at a bench. Okay, up we go. Need to find us a bench. There you go. Did you visit that temple? A strange building I've heard, thought I'd never dare to journey myself. The braver among us once went there to pray, said they felt at peace within the walls. After a while they stopped going. I wonder what's changed. Vasilis, I'd never play Fallout 76 for a couple of reasons. First and foremost, they sold people a third. It was a piece of shit. The fact that it didn't have NPCs had nothing to do with narrative. It was so they wouldn't have to animate NPCs. Because Bethesda are pieces of shit as well. And uh, then when the game started becoming functional, they charged people for lobbies and storage. So no. 
That's not happening. I'm not I'm not paying for assholery in general. No, no, no. A young this. couple just recently taken up residence in the house beside the station. Seems they're running a map shop which may excite adventurous types like yourself. She's a tall bug, the wife. I told them to take a larger house, especially given they're all empty, but they like the look of that one. The way she was to bend just to get through the door, I wouldn't put up with it myself. Yolo no. To go this. Many used to come, hoping the kingdom would fulfill their desires. Hollow Nest, it was once called. Supposedly the greatest kingdom there ever was, full of treasures and secrets. Now it's nothing more than a poisonous tomb full of monsters and madness. Pythonk? Dude, I totally agree with you. Sometimes you want to pass the time, but w most of these games you realize demand like a hundred hours of your time. Why spend a hundred hours collecting papayas? Do you really need to murder a hundred hours of your life? I don't know, brother. Everything fades eventually, I suppose. Feeling tired? That bench may be iron, but I assure you it's quite comfortable. There's no better place to collect your thoughts before heading below. Plus, I enjoy the company. Not that you seem the talkative sort. Well, I'm very short and I have no mouth, so... Trish, tell me you bought it. You son of a bitch. Okay, now we have a map. Let's see. I am tiny. I am here. Okay, so places that are just the diagram without the blue filling are places I haven't visited. Uh, you can do another thing whilst you do that, Trish. Just letting you know. <laughs> You go get it, my man. You go get it. The way my legs sound reminds me of something, but I can't put my finger on it. Come on. That is true, Vasilis, but why do we enjoy certain things? Do we ever stop to think of it? I'm gonna give you an example. When I was younger, Back in the day, I used to play a lot of Fantasy Star Online on the Dreamcast. Um, Fantasy Star Online is a very, it was a very tactical game for the standards of its time, you know, the combat, the timing required, all that stuff. It was a very worthwhile experience. I'd find myself playing it uh, just to soothe my nerves, just to chill. But at some point I stopped and thought like, Am I getting anything new out of the experience at that point? For me, liking the game was like a, a safety bubble. It, I, I was so accustomed to it. You know, a, a repetition is like a, a soothing action. You, some people just move their leg up and down. Some people play Diablo. The thing is... Do you keep doing it because you enjoy it, as in, it's just so familiar, it soothes you? And if yes, how much of it is actually worth doing again and again? I used to play Destiny, man. I have like thousands of hours in Destiny, and at some point I just stopped and said, you could have played a treasure troves of video games instead of this shit for 4,000 hours of your life. 
It's not like I'm not guilty, but you have to reach the realization. If you have five times, five hours a day to either have fun or entertain yourself, some of it should probably go into entertainment and not just having fun. Those are not synonymous. Yeah, at some point, do that. Enjoy your comfort food. Play the comfort game. Just don't miss on out on everything just to feel comfortable because... Dude, you're just numbing yourself. You're not... You're not soothing yourself. You're numbing yourself. It's like... You know, too many painkillers. Painkillers are nice, but you don't have to take them every day. I'm just relaying my thought process, guys. I'm not gonna tell you what to play. But there are certain there are certain things in this industry that I think are... How should I put it? Are pretty insulting. Insulting is a good word. little fella can't take it yet salamandra is teasing me on twitch saying play the callisto protocol i'd rather play with my penis after i dip it in sand and then give it a good rub just to see the blood coming out. You know I streamed the entire thing back in the day, right? Callisto Protocol from start to finish when it wasn't even playable. That was insulting, man. You're welcome, Trace. I love you, man. <laughs> Excellent wish. Ooh. Okay, now that is strange. Why am I here? I went right past from the opening that goes into the curve and now suddenly I'm on the left side of the map with nothing in between how do I update my map for the in-between segments where am I now? Yes, I'm there, but the map is not updated. I've been lied to. Okay, bench. The farming simulators? That's a mighty statement. You know, when uh, Star Troopers Extermination came out, I streamed that game, made some content. And I made a vid about it and I was saying like, this is good fun. This is good fun, especially with friends. But man, I can't see this becoming anyone's solo uh, pastime. Like, it's so unknown. But I have people I know that played it religiously for weeks. It's a game where you build fortifications and shoot big bugs. I don't know, bro. 
Okay, so here I cannot go. Because I need to open these. Let's find the bench seat, get our bearings. It's here, right? <laughs> who is who is? Oh, this mofo is not a boss? Oh, yeah. So, this is not the hot spring. Back here with Kaburiz. It's not the bench, is it? No, it's this. I'm getting a little lost. I have to keep my wits. Can I go there? I go to Death Mouth. Yeah, it's. I think it's the most approachable. Yep, we're here. Okay. Ah, <sighs> Panada. Okay, the, most, the more markers you put around, the more understanding you have of your uh, relevant placement, so... Good thing it auto-marks. Okay, so I suppose I go left all the way down and then I can either go... Man, left we're missing two areas, what the hell? One below. Ooh, nice. Those mosquitoes have uh, pretty suspicious mouths. They're like nom, 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 nom. no. I bust my jump. I'm not sure I understand what this thing does. 
but we'll see. Okay, this requires some technique that I do not have currently. Yeah, I can only imagine. Dude, it's a huge bug nest. I suppose it's gonna be humongous. Ah, you son of a bug. Literally. Okay, let's hit the bench. Character is pretty adorable, man. Okay, here the map says I can go down, but I can't. Anyway, now we have a better understanding. Like we can go all the way right, and I suppose we'll circumvent the dumb double uh, metal doors. Okay. Oh, you son of a bitch. How do you refill your healing when you attack enemies? Come on, man. I didn't go this way. Am I Malakas? Say, 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 say the magic word. I'm Malakas, I'm Malakas. Bitch.
Oh, she has a tiny map and he takes notes. I'm gonna puke a rainbow. A tall machine with a symbol of a stag. Insert geo. Not yet. I suppose this is a train. Let's wait for a sec. Guys, can we get 40 likes, please? Okay, so I was, uh, should open them. Lexicon, welcome. First time I see you here, my man. There you go. Come on. Yeah, I have to go above. Man, that sounds like creepy crawlies. Excellent lexicon, glad to have you here, my man. So, I left for the boss. Um, let's explore a bit more. Dude, it's Buck the Reaper. Son of a bitch. By my deeds am I known, and they're truly buggy. That's a thick bag. Oh, the thicker they are, the more hit points they have? strike a door with an open slot what does that mean found myself a secret too You're gonna get us demonetized, bro. What? Who's Cruz? Tom, I didn't say anything about Scientology, I swear. You can believe whatever you think, like your Thetan will be fine!
Scientology sucks, Tom. No! God damn it! Jesus. Talk to me, goose. <laughs> Maybe not yet. It's fine, Sifis. It's gonna be okay, I promise. Okay, this won't be opening now. Should go to the train station and unlock it. Your soul. I would show you my foot, but I don't do that for free. You, sh you have to go to my OnlyFans. Here we go. Oh shit! Mother bugger! Horo, horo. Horo, horo. Greetings little one. It's been an age since I last heard the ringing of a station bell. It echoed down the stagways and called to me. I've grown stiff and tired over these many years and I've forgotten much, but the sound of the bell will always call me back. This stagway stretches the depths of Hollow Nest. If you want to travel them, hail me from the platform. I will take you where we need to go. Abracadabra. Okay, good, good. Noise. So I suppose I go one up and then start going left and I'll reach the boss. Son of a bitch. Nice Panagotis. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Come on, you. Oh, 
Oh shit! Oh wave. It's a Greek Prime Minister. Just a bit smarter. Let's try. Okay. Arty, that's that's a scary proposition. Thank you, thank you. First try, peeps. Not bad, not bad. City crest. Load. Wait, can I get into the box? King in the castle, king in the castle, I have a chair, king in the castle. Okay, what's this way? Rahim, it's supposedly one of the best games of its kind, so... Do you like Metroidvanias? Well, I think you'll like it, man. So far, it's very nice. Oh, I have a video cassette now. Sorry I missed you. If you're feeling lost, why not pop up to your store in Dirtmouth and purchase a map of this area? Available now for an excellent price. Oh, okay. It's the dude. Yeah, I made a, I made a roundabout. Man, people with a foot fetish are gonna have a treat playing this game. You hear the steps like a plyatch, 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 like bare feet. Oh, there's a um, bug. Namino, 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 namino. Oh. -ho! Who is that creeping out from the darkness? My, you're looking grim. A strange empty face and a wicked looking weapon. 
Excellent, Carlos. Something important has drawn you down into Hollowness Corpse, but I won't ask what. Perhaps the reason you found me is because you need my help? Say no more, friend. I'm going to give you a gift, a nasty little spell of my own creation. It's just perfect for a little one like you. <laughs> First try, Carlos. First try. Kicked his ass. Vengeful spirit. Tap RT to unleash the spirits. Spells will deplete soul. Replenish soul by striking enemies or listening to the radio if you're in Louisiana. She trapped me. No, 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 no. Oh, you woken up at last. I apologize. Perhaps I should have warned you about the power of that spell. I was watching over you as you slept, but seemed to have slipped away myself. Ho, oh, oh, ho, oh. ho. Now we're awake. I was wondering why you would do me a small favor. Not as repayment for my gift, of course, simply because we're now friends. You see, a horrid great beast has made its home in the heart of the temple. Such disrespect. It would be quite grateful if you were to venture deeper in and slay it for me. It's a hardy creature, but with your new power, you're more than a match for it. Good luck with the small favor, my friend. Ho, 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 ho. No, me no, no, me no. <laughs> What's this? Are you wondering about this gate between us? Ho, ho, ho. It's a curious thing, but this door will not open unless you have slain that creature lying in the heart of the temple. Don't worry about it. I'm sure the spirits of my ancestors will be watching over you. I got played. Yep, that's what I thought, Frank. I can also get that little bugger who was away from me. So attacking Leech's energy soul as it's called and you can use it both for healing and for powering your spells booyah i cannot fire it upwards though huh A shisha? What, what, the, what the F is that? Should I be worried? Hmm. Little sucker. He wanted me to lure me into the small corridor, so if I jumped, I'd hit the nails over my head. I feel like a doofus. That's what it does. <laughs> okay, so that's the rhythm of these suckers. Hmm. 
Game has an interesting balance between when you get pushed and when you push enemies. Sweet. I got extra slimy. That's the way I like it. Come on. Oh, I can't? I was like 100% sure if I jumped here, I'd transition a screen. Hmm. I've been lied to. The extra health is trying to escape. I don't know. Oh, that's how I get it. That's nice. It teaches you what needs to happen here in the most reactive way. Soul catcher. What's this? Used by summons to draw more soul from the world around them. Increase the amount of soul gain when striking an enemy with a sail. Okay. We need this. So it's done then, you've slain the beast. The poor thing, it must have been terrified of you. It used to be quite docile, but the rancid air in this caverns filled it with some ancient rage. Still you did what had to be done. You have my gratitude. Of course, we both know you wouldn't have made it through without that spell of mine. Ho ho ho! And look, the gate between us has opened! Ho ho ho! I'm sure you're eager to move on. Farewell and have faith. Whatever you're seeking, it'll find you. Ow, ho, ho, ho. Frank does it now. What do you know about these things? Should I be worried? Are you mingling with a gang of Spurgitia? Okay, so where are we? <laughs> now, what do we need to do? Yes, excellent. Thank you, Lexicon. Ta da! Improved our economy. So, one thing we can do is blast that sucker that was blocking the path and also we can blast the bag that's uh, one of the collectibles
Is that guy above us? I think that bug we need to take care of is one level above us and to the left. do that my god come on you have to be aware of the height of the jumps you should not be just over committing to the jump Thing. If you start healing and you start consuming soul to heal, uh, but you don't commit enough, you still lose the part that you committed into the heal. That's some fine way to grow a tumor. I see what you did there. <sighs> Keep farting down there.
Okay. Let's use our tiny map. You don't have the map of this area. Hmm, okay, we're in a different biome. Hey, start lover. Okie dokie. It's time to do 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 duel. Ooh, huh. a bagirina. Yeah, that's, uh, that's what I gathered because of the artworks. Okay, barely got a double heal here. Imagine being this tiny studio of three people, creating a game like this, becoming a cult classic, and then getting like investors coming in saying, take our money and make the next one. Such a cleansing experience, bro. Cabani's farts are called the silk song because his ass is soft as silk. You know, stands to reason. Okay, we have to take a precise fall here. Or do we? Oh, cut it. Nice. Seriously now. Can I push it? No. Okay. Ha <laughs> ha! Too sham awful. the shortcut there he is 
Isn't this a contrast from the crossroads? Such a humid, lively place. The roads twist and turn in the most wonderful ways. I've done my best to chart the area ahead, though I must admit some of the area's inhabitants proved quite a nuisance. Purchase them up. Yes. I ran into another traveler as I made my way down here. I tried to call out to her as she dashed past, but she barely even glanced in my direction. Not an appreciator of maps like you and I, obviously. I ran into another travel game. Okay. We killed them, but now we have to smash them to mush for good measure. I am Babis. Tiny squib, you approach fearless. Are you a hunter like me? Do you feel the urge inside to stalk, to kill, to understand? Then take it, my journal. It will aid you. At first the text may seem difficult to discern, but a learned hunter will come to understand its words. Venture the depths of this land and slay these beasts. Prove yourself worthy to bear the mark of hunter. Oh, a bestiary. Okay. The Hunter Babies. Juro Noctuba. Little Squib. You may have overcome a few creatures, but you are only just beginning. Don't delay. Descend into the belly of this world and hunt down the life you find. Okay. Okay. Ah, oh, shit. Hello, little fella. Bala la wa bala. Dum 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 dum. Up. Oh. Oh, that's a chunker. Dude, this projectile attack that I got is so satisfying to use. Like, you feel the damage it's causing. Costadinos, we have a ways to go for that, man. 
Are these streams gonna be viable for this game to become 100%? Only time will tell. Can I cross here? Oh yes, I can. Ah! <laughs> it's shit. Yeah, that's very Castlevania. Like you did the game 100%, now I do it 100% in three bulls testicles. Like, why, man? There is a reason 100% supposed to be max. Oh, that's how it's gonna be now. I shouldn't. I should go below. Oh, I have my fucking god. Can't. Whoever designed this dudette that you meet is a freaking genius, man. You take a bug design and you make it look feminine, you have to be a freaking genius. Okay, let's go the way she went. Ah, you little shit. Precision, precision, precision. Okay, now I have a better understanding of where I am. Should I go below first and search? I feel like we're moving upwards quite aggressively.
No, she went through here. So we probably should ascend. You little pooper. Metroid Dread I didn't play, to be honest. I remember when Metroid Dread came out, people were selling simple copies of it for 100 euros. Like, the Nintendo crowd really are special people, man. Why pay 100 euros for the standard edition that the game, of a game that just came out? Of course, there are gonna be copies available. They're not gonna disappear. The limited edition does a different story. Double jump, what are you talking about, man? Enjoy the show. Excellent. The greater mind once dreamed of a leaf and cast this cover and so in every bush and every vine the mind of Earn reveals itself to us. I thought I hit something. Oh, there it is. That was it. Okay, fine. Ah, uh, Frank, what do you mean, my man?
Man, this game is all about the creepy crawlers. You hear the, the legs all the time, like. Chicka, 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 chicka. Yeah, yeah. No, man, Nintendo is... Nintendo is a very special company, that's how I'm gonna put it. They must be, like... Eh, come on, fucker. Must be the worst at preserving their own legacy. And, like... So many games lost to time because they don't give a shit. Or they want to re-release them, like, in 20 years and force people to pay an arm and a leg. I'm really not very fond of Nintendo, to be honest. I'm not fond of predatory practices, and because they're everywhere these days, I find myself not liking being companies more and more. Sue me. Christos, what's up, man? Haven't seen you in a while. Did you get married? Yep, Frank, exactly. Yeah, man, when you have a fan base as loyal, you can either treat them with respect or take a huge dung on their faces, and Nintendo does the latter far more than the former. Okay, I think I need a horizontal dash here. Yeah, Cabanis, that's because we paid them too much for them to become greedy. Yeah, I cannot traverse this. I can fuck myself though. Christos, you're punching way above your weight, bro. Stay where you are, deep breaths, you'll do fine. Yeah, yeah. Did I want to do that? I am pretty sure I didn't. the hell? Come back here, you cannibal. We creepy crawlies should stand together. Oh, she's sad. Look at that face. I, on the other hand, am totally chill. Akala, eh, man? <laughs> A Akala, Timalakas. Just what do you think you're doing? You dare to come between me and my prey? Is it a habit of yours to scurry about getting in the way of causing bother? Know this, cur. I am Zod the Mighty, a knight of great renown. Cross me again, and you'll find out why they call my weapon Life Ender.
Okay, Christos, excellent. Nah. Well, you still bother me for. I'm a knight. I'm not interested in your childish games. I need my rest. Be gone, lest I draw my nail. Yeah, I'm you down. You little shit. Sure. The grandchildren walked from the dream onto these lands. Here we now shall wait patient for the call to return. Le can Bro, I'm the shit. The shit is my home now. I need to heal, I can't go down there like this. It's kinda strange that they uh, block all frontal assault. Like, do you have a charge attack later to break the defenses? You the son of a bitch. First death. These are tricky. These suckers are tricky. Where the fuck did I end up? Okay. Yeah, man, of course, it takes away your money. That's the logic of this genre. I have to go and uh, reclaim my stuff, I suppose. Yeah, yeah, that's what I did with one of the two guys. But it's kind of problematic if they block all frontal assaults. Come on, man.
Yeah, of course, I can't go this way. What am I missing now? What am I forgetting? I have to go above and around. Okay. My own shadow? The music is so dreamy, man. It's like you dream of a snail crawling up your anus. Just much more beautiful and less snail up your anus. Hey, what's up, my man? You good? Oh shit, it's mini me. <laughs> Who's the man? Fired, fired. <laughs> Is this the boss? You've got to be kidding me here. Guys, warn me of this shit! Chat be like, uh, if you do this, your farts will turn pink. Then I have to circumvent half a map, and you suckers don't say anything. Cabanis was sent to Horny Prison. God damn it. He's getting bonked by the Shiba Inu.
Sproio. Fuck off! Okay. We need the bench. Spend all my tokens. How the hell am I gonna spend a thousand tokens, bro? Train station somewhere around here, maybe? And this projectile kicks ass. I love it. it. Requires a lot of energy, but it does a lot of damage. This makes no sense. How did I circumvent the, the entire level? What the hell? Was I always able to just walk through here to the left and proceed this way? Suppose not. Oh. Yeah, this needs the dash. Man, I have to redo the entire map. Uh, 
<laughs> well, is oh my god, fuck off, fart guy. Is there a way to get there, like in in, in humane manner? God, screw you! Screw you, you son of a bitch! Okay, there's also this path. Oh, that's a different bench. Okay. Nick Turtles, my boy, what is up? Okay guys, uh, we have a lot of peeps watching tonight, so uh, here is a little gift. Who grabbed them? Wombleboss, Cavuriz, Steven, MM and Nymphus, all staples of the channel. You're worth it, my peeps. Mwah. I don't even need to ask you to renew them. You're awesome. Excellent, Nick. Cav, of course, man. You can enjoy the awesome custom made emojis. Oh shit! Nick is taking care of the rest. Who grabbed them? Cabani, Stefano, Tassos, Joseph, and Asan. Thank you, bro. Thank you so much. You're great! <laughs> we found something! Thank you, my man. Oh, so wholesome, excellent. Oh. I can actually jump some. Dude, what is this? That's a recipe for disaster. Spooky. Oh shit. I think I should probably get a light source before coming in here, right? Yeah.
Yep, 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 yep. I'll wait until I can see where I'm going. I don't think I can... Can I step on this? Oh, I know what I have to do. Well, I, I sure as fuck didn't have to do that, I can tell you. Let's go heal at the bench. Where's the bench? Oh, it's one layer above. Great. Okay, question. Is there a train shortcut so I can go back to town and uh, spend some of the tokens? Wild, you are my hero. Son of a bitch. Come on, don't push me backwards, man. Oh, I'm gonna commit suicide here. There is a bank here. Don't come here yet. Okay. Okay, I think we should do the boss. I wanted to see if there is a shortcut. In case we screw up, just go to the city and spend stuff. Come on, plant.
Come on, dude. Panayotis, you can find me on Facebook, of course, because you found me on Joystick, but Discord is our main thing. Uh, come to Discord, and if you want to, you know, put forward the game, we will discuss it. I'll be happy to oblige. Okay, this is a new path. Oh, this is gonna be tricky. I don't think I wanna be here. I just wanna open a dumb shortcut. You know, I am pretty sure Hellpoint got its healing system from this game. Because you leech energy from your... Man, mosquitoes hate me even in games. You leech energy from your enemies as you attack them and that fills your healing charges. Salamandra, yeah, probably a lantern as people say. Well, that's the whole point of these games, isn't it? You cheat yourself up. Oh, that did absolutely zero things. Yeah, it's a good system. It's a good system because it means that during a fight, you're not restricted to what you came in with. You can recharge your stuff. Of course, you have to hit more than you get hit. But that's kind of always the, the thing you should be striving for, so... Dude, you fell like a potato on my fucking head. That's not very polite.
Yeah, but uh, when the boss falls prone after you stagger it, you can both heal and damage it. So it's a win-win when you manage those staggers. It's good. Guys, is there any way I can open a shortcut to town? Eat it. We haven't gone this way. Oh, that's why we didn't go this way. Yes, this is the spot where I said we can't go without the dash. <sighs> I want to check what's up there. You gotta excuse me. Nothing we can interact with. Well, guess we're doing it. Well, yeah, man, we're not gonna go ultra meta on the speedrun tactics, though. It's the first playthrough. Dude, I hate this little asshole with a passion. Okay, boss. Yes. Drosik Halimo. Come no closer, ghost. I've seen you creeping through the undergrowth, stalking me. This old kingdom, a terrible thing awakens. I can smell it in the air. I know what you are. I know what you try to do. I can't allow it.
I'm just so good. Welcome to the stream, guys. Eighty four people watching. My God, oh my God, I'm getting spammed by the joystick crew. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Makis didn't manage to play much uh, Difna Hospital, right? <laughs> ah, man, I'm getting trolled. I'm getting trolled. <laughs> okay, wait, I got something for you. <laughs> Enjoy some dolmen. <laughs> guys, guys, guys. The Stunis. Prote for Arches is the stream of a Karajosi clone. <laughs> oh, this is so sweet. <laughs> Okay, it's the, the the first and only time on my stream where there are more Greeks than foreign people. <laughs> Expose. <laughs> oh, Kostas, thank you so much. Mwah. Thank you, guys. Ευχαριστώ πέδες. Τι έγινε, δεν την παλέψαμε με το... In the game. Jida <laughs> Vraste. Thank you, peeps. Thank you. Thank you so much. So dramatic. Beave. <laughs> okay, who's gonna sponsor the Dolmen stream? <laughs> Guys, thank you, thank you, thank you. My god, the entity itself, Joystick GR, is throwing the dough. Oh, guys, that's so touching. Thank you so much. Mwah! Okay, cheers to all of you guys. Thank you for being here. Ευχαριστώ πολύ, παιδάκια. Thank you, Nico. <laughs> that's my stone. <laughs> Guys, Dolmen is right here. Okay, who wants to sponsor the Dolmen stream? I dare you, I double fucking dare you. It also had DLC with it. I'm not even joking. Man, what an awful piece of shit. I'm never touching this again. The first uh, 5A game. <laughs> Callisto Protocol <laughs> We're going from bad to worse Dude, I would do a Dolmen giveaway But it was a gift from Kalsas So I can't give it away I'm cursed Boy, thank you so much, man Pips, you are great Thank you so much Love you all You know what? Kavu! Kavu is going on all platforms! 
<laughs> okay, for the foreign people who don't speak Greek, Joystick is like, I'll get you the collector's edition of Dolmen. <laughs> Give it away. <laughs> Cabanis. Ευχαριστώ πολύ, παιδες. Είστε γαμάτι. Σας αγαπώ πολύ. Ελπίζω να σας αρέσει το triple A. Jericho 1990. Gollum. Αυτό κακό στο χειρότερο. Θέλετε να δείτε Hollow Knight, παιδες. Should we play some Hollow Knight? What do you think? Zanaedol Madakia or the other ones from Discount Market. <laughs> the Dolmen Protocol. It pushes some Dolmadakia up your protocolos. <laughs> Where's Chico, by the way? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the Dolmen Ultras. <laughs> I've been raided by the Dolmen Ultras. <laughs> Guys, this is such an awesome occasion. Thank you so much. This is great. <laughs> the OGs. The people who played that shit first. Μπιβ, κάνε ένα κανάλι στο Discord του Joystick Dolmen Ultras. <laughs> oh, guys, thank you so much. You are great. You are great. <laughs> Protocol. <laughs> you know, Dolmen plays co-op. Να βάλουμε το beef να τα αγοράσει και να το παίξουμε co-op. <laughs> Αφού είναι εδώ, βρω μοιάρης. Γιώργος, you don't know how bad it is. That's why you're making fun of it. It's such a piece of shit. <laughs> Σκορπιός για σένα. Okay, dash forwards by pressing B. Let's play some Hollow Knight. It was requested by Costadinos, my boy. Hell divers. <laughs> Oh, a tiny dust. What? Why did I explode? Would you seek to break the seals? They cannot be undone. They must be undone. Let us sleep, little shadow. Return to your darkness. Allow us our peace. Minas, I, uh, I am not optimistic, mate. I don't think that they're gonna nail it, to be honest. Oh my god, I suck. Well, I know people playing this get angry, 
So far I've only died once and it wasn't even at the boss, it was like bad management of the twin night assholes. Okay, that's the train probably. Son of a bitch, I thought he wasn't. I hate these guys. Yorgos, first time, yeah. Have no idea what's happening. And Batod, I don't know. We'll see. Hello there. Seems we both tread far from the path. I can hardly believe those dusty old highways led to such a lush and lively place. This building suggests some form of worship, though its idol has clearly been long forgotten. Doubles equally well for a moment's respite. Yeah, this is Chico's game. Chico is never here. Bye bye, Sotiris. Uh. Akistar is excellent so far, man. Very well done. I saw a strange fellow out there. He seemed quite taken by the late. I planned to offer greetings, though figured I'd first tend to my nail to change the meeting goes poorly. Your nail looks a fine instrument, but it's showing signs of wear. I'd wager up there it would take you far. Down here, however, I suspect it'll soon meet dangers the surface world can't match. Hmm. Balonis is perfect for regional explorers like us, so 10 cents reeling. In this place, you're either alert or you're dead. Hmm. Ah. For a moment, I thought that was a blacksmith to upgrade my weapon. <laughs> Costas, it's the nature of the channel, man. I have to do a stream on uh, joystick, though. We'll do it in Greek there. Yorgos yields expires? What the hell? What's their excuse? You forget what you know? Damn assholes. The art direction is great, man. Art direction is great, music is great, very responsive. Maki X for Eternal. Do Eternal. Well, this was Frank's idea, but Chico loves this. We got have them both on comms. Mm. 
Okay, let's go back to town. Yoros, I have no idea where the hell they do that, man. I have Cambridge, so... That's never been a, a thing. Okay. Oh, you have to get the... Switcheroo. Oh, is that asshole? Uh, you there, why are you skulking about in the shadows? Yes, your eyes do not deceive you. I am Zod the Mighty, a knight of great renown. Tremble before me. While you were hiding here in your dingy little village, I ventured into the dark pit below us and slew a great beast. It had sharp mandibles and atrocious manners. Yes, yes, all glory to me. But I don't have time for your adulation. I must rest and prepare for my just journey next journey down. Yep. I think Biv played it on PC. Uh, I have it on PS5. If I speak English on joystick, you're gonna burn me at the stake. <laughs> the dumbass stream. <laughs> yeah. Magnum opus. Oh, what? What's this guy? Serema. Yeah. Pale thing, you wear that nail with keys. If you're in search of combat, you'll find no great warriors in this decaying burrow. I've heard an arena exists somewhere below, one built for our like. Meet me there and we'll test what skills you possess. I'll be heading down soon. Come and find me if you dare. Okay, there's an arena, I suppose, a completionist thingy. <laughs> You'll be Maruska. I'll have the Evian spraying myself. Star is because we are like spicy food, you have to get used to it. <laughs> I, t I was telling them that thumbnail they made for Dark Souls. Maki should be wearing a sombrero, and Theo would be the goat and be great, man. But they didn't listen. PC. I'm, I'm playing on the PC that I'm streaming from as well. Not the best arrangement. Yeah, meet and greet. Meet 
Meet and Greed. Malaperdes. <laughs> the music is excellent in general. This is this is really good. Ah! I penetrated my own anus. It's it's really good so far. I think I'll play some more. Oh, there we are. No, oh, you son of a bitch. I got hit and I didn't get damage, and I, then I fucked. <sighs> Bro, come on. I have jump here on the paddle and sometimes I don't click it enough and I do stupid shit. Okay. I did not expect that. Bro, I did not expect that at all. Where am I? <laughs> I only died twice My second death is the one you just saw So far it's very manageable Yeah, I'm experienced in this kind of game though People who don't have experience with this kind of thing Will probably say it's very difficult No, that's the Victrix. Um, that's for PlayStation. The Wolverine I have for Xbox. I have the wired one. And uh, it has vibration, but not haptics. Well, all vibration is haptics. But it doesn't have the precise vibration of the DualSense. All in all, it's a vastly superior controller to the DualSense. Like the dual sense in general, I was never a fan of. Wait, where do I go? Boy, yep, first time, man. First playthrough. Oh my god, come on.
Okay, let's get our balls back. Figuratively and literally. There you are. In these games in general, number one uh, priority is to keep your cool. And uh, it, it seems very fair, exactly as Sifi said. This game seems very fair so far. I can appreciate that. Oh man, I screwed that. Wasted energy for nothing here. Bro, this is cancer, Jesus Christ. At least if you destroy one... God damn it, yeah, there's no way they're gonna survive tonight, these two fuckers. Hornet Akestar, you mean the the one that gives you the dash? I got her first try, man. Not even close, like it was very manageable. I don't know, Metroidvanias are growing on me. It's not my favorite genre, but they are growing on me. Roguelikes, on the other hand, I love those things. I hope I'll get. Uh, Technical beta test for uh, access for Hades 2. Hades 2 I really want to play. The double knights fight that is in the dungeon here. Th those guys are tough, man. Okay, Kabul, thank you for the generosity, my man. See you soon. Oh, fudge. Okay, there's no way I'm going in there without full energy. It's, it's suicide. I just screwed myself. Okay, let's reset this instance. Panayot is the Hydra, you mean? Lerni. The base form. You know when you increase the heat in Hades, bosses become like 20 times harder. There is a version of him that is immune to damage unless you break his shields. Pretty good boss though.
I love roguelikes. I love roguelikes because they bring an element of freshness with each run. Yeah, Meletis, the whole point of this is because there are people, like, like 25 people that were here before who don't speak Greek, bro. Like, on average, only the Greeks speak Greek. Okay, let's go. Okay, now it's manageable. Now we're good. Boulder cell. I'm pretty sure there is an opening to go vertically here. Okay. <laughs> no, I haven't played Dead Cells. I have its Prisoner Edition and it's still in the cellophane. Okay, see, this is a loot run. You come here for loot. So it's either down and right or down. Oh, Fog Canyon. Oh, shit. Biv, I'm awaiting awesome news of the job situation, okay? Keep me in the loop. Dimitris, did you try Trinity Fusion? Excellent, Biv. That's it, baby. We survived. Now we get all the gyros. Yeah, man, it's uh, uh, really affordable and it is really good. Really good. Good aesthetics, good combat, interesting scenario. It's it's good. Oh, it's those cunts. Okay, let's rest here.
Kostas jis gaz ir invincibility glitch? Yikes! No, that was self-explanatory. I can't go this way. Yeah, no way. I need some other method of traversal here. From moss and leaf our life is drawn, while it grows upon the path we shall never wilt. That requires a longer dash. Son of a bitch. Oh my god. Hmm. That seems hazardous to my mental health. Thorns of Agony Okay, we're collecting stuff Acid Bubble, bye bye man Kalnikta Okay, Fog Canyon, I suppose. It's shit. Guys, can we get a hundred likes? We have all the Greek gang here tonight. We should be able to do it.
Yeah, this is the most defenseless enemy in the entire game. Those who stray from the White King's road shall face the law of Un. Kostas, kalinikta. Thank you, Panayotis. See you around, man. Oh, you son of a bitch. That's not even a boss, man. It's just an enemy. Japanos people say it's huge. I won't know until I play more, I suppose. Oh my god, you s <clears throat> That was fucking annoying here. I was trying to heal there, but no. Shadow is here. Bro, come on, don't don't be an asshole like that. Okay, did I come here to die?
Uh, I took a risk here. Fucked it up. The, the location with the spitting shits. Fog Canyon is next. Let me get some water. It starts very manageable, but it integrates many systems afterwards and becomes quite hard, which is good. Okay, I have to take my tokens and then we'll go into the um, Fog Canyon area. Because obviously, uh, going there now is not the best idea. Son of a bitch. Physical or limited physical? Yes, if it's a goal there, like... Uh... Fog Canyon there on the right. Okay. There's a little secret. Our shadow is here. <laughs> oh, fuck off. Okay, this is very doable, but I have to be precise. Jump for fuck's sake, jump, I clicked the button, Jesus. Just get my shit and go because 
I have a throbbing vein here now. I'm about to suffer a stroke. I'm getting fucking pissed. No, 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 no. First run of any every game I do as intended. And then I I might do a modded run, but the first one is as the developers intended. Very few exceptions. Where's my shadow, man? Dude, is my shadow on the other side of the lake? Oh my god, okay. This is, this is Cancer 101. Hey Fear, what's up man? Wait, so now to turn back I have to do it again? <laughs> hmm, not necessarily. You fucking cocksucker! Dude! Jesus!
Okay, heal here at the bench. Okay, here we are. Dude, is it homing? Is it always going to hit me? Okay, the map guy is there. I think I have to go around. James, it's a pretty excellent, bro. It's very good. It has some uh, areas that are designed to, to give you grief. But that's the nature of the genre, I think. It's good. It's very good. Of course, before finishing it, I can't say, like, with 100% certainty. Of course, why wouldn't it explode in my face? Is this the train station? Goa, Nudo Island. Isn't this something? I did not expect to discover so huge a stag station after that foggy descent. The bugs of Hollowness must have been an impressive lot building such grand structures so far into these wilds. Seems the dangerous creatures about haven't yet made their way in here. It's the perfect place for a quick rest. Who is this ninja bug? Vasilius, that's true. Can you imagine this place in its time? Hordes of bugs traveling about the kingdom, stuck bells ringing, the station bustling with activity and life. Now only our like even know it exists. That's a special thing, I suppose, to cherish these sites even in their decay. Hmm. Isn't that just faintly you can still hear the echo of the bells? Actually, you can hear the echo of the bells. He's not crazy.
What's this? Oh, Kevin searched for treats, haven't you? I chanced upon a unique little fungus growing right above us. I found it only in this station and the taste is just divine. This place must once have been quite the hub, built at the border between two lands, that misty drop to one side and those bulbous growths another. Neither place seems particularly welcoming, so while my little treats last, I think I'll stay right here. Yeah, yeah. Feel free to stop by any time, though I do like the quiet in this station, a little company is always good for one's health. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Bye bye, Beeb. Tube, mm -hmm. where? Okay, I can't go here. At last! Don't have it. Cabani, you know who this guy is? You've opened several stag stations now, haven't you? I'm thankful for the opportunity to once more travel through the kingdom. As I visit more places, I feel my memories returning to me, like the stagways of my mind are running once more. Continue to open the stations and you'll have my deepest gratitude. After more supplies, you've already bought so much. Unfortunately for now, you've cleaned us out of anything worth selling. Cornifer will no doubt be pleased, though I do wonder what he plans to spend all that geo on. Kalostus. <laughs> you are close. Welcome, Ton. What the hell are these creepy crawlies, man? Best name ever, man. <laughs> I 
Underwood, my man, are you still there? Okay, I was like, he's awfully silent. I hope he didn't leave his own stream. We need the map, we need the map! Charm notch. Ah, so we can equip more charms now. You're a little tired, bro? What time is it? Oh, it's 11 past 2 in the morning, dude. We did good. Yeah, see if it's, I haven't found an upgrade kind of station yet, though. The guy with the maps is at the beginning, that is true. But uh, he was behind the barrier. <laughs> no. I'm just a bit experienced with this kind of game. It's quite challenging, but uh, if you think on your feet, it's kinda manageable.
Platforming is my biggest bane in all these games. Like, platforming can be a son of a bitch. Uh, it blasted itself. We remember the Elder. Okay, I don't know what that means, but... I suppose they do remember the Elder. Thank you, Cephas. I don't like the fact that the dust does not give you any iframes. Dude, back in my prime playing Eternal, I was I was very competent. I'm not gonna lie. Is that an enemy? No, it's a character. Oh, oh, oh. The tiny steps of a tiny creature. You've got the look of an adventurer, so we've much in common. Searching for dangerous places, I? Well, you're on the right track. A long-necked creature warned me of a tribal deeper down. Of a tribe deeper down. Warrior source. So she says, I'm itching for some serious combat. Keep sharp, my adventurous friend. Stay alive and let's meet again on the road ahead. Yeah, platforming pisses me off. I overcome at the end, but... Uh, yeah, the tumors are real. Jesus. Stinger. There is a Metroidvania coming out. Eden's Guardian is the name. The platforming in that game is gonna be nuts. You throw your sword and you grab it and you can throw it to teleport yourself at the spot where you threw it. It's pretty insane. Very free form. But dude, it's gonna be AIDS. Come on. Yeah, yeah, I played the demo on stream. I try to bring so much new and exciting stuff to these streams, man. Here ends the Pilgrim's Way. Hollowness heart lays open before you. Proceed onward to share in its glory. 
Oh, that's not a bridge. Of course it isn't. Why would it be? What was I thinking? So we can't go here yet. Fucking Christ, stop it. I hit down attack. Fuck. Yeah, the art design is pretty excellent. What's she doing here? We have to go find the map guy, dude, it's... I'm gonna lose my hair in here. through here not passing through this Thank God. Don't try to sneak past me, I can smell you. Do you collect a lot of Geo? Give me Geo and you can see something nice. <sighs> Pay to see something nice, dude, that's, that's like... That's so... <laughs> Let me show you then, take a look. Do you want them? If you really, really want them, I'll trade them for more Geo. More Geo! Fragile Heart. This is a precious thing, a beautiful charm. I made it for you. If you hold it, you'll feel a lot healthier. If you're afraid of dying, you need this charm. Very, very special valuable charm. Do you want to find more Geo? Hold this charm and go hunting. Then bring any Geo you find back to me. Fragile Strength. You're weak, aren't you? You should give me Geo. If you do, I'll give you this charm I made. It will make you stronger. Your enemies and everyone else will fear you at last. Uh, should I buy them or are they like... Breaking after a while and it will be a waste? Are they break if I die? Okay. They don't sound like such a good investment.
Okay, let's buy them. Yeah, let's just buy them. I will not equip them so they don't break. And eventually we can repair them so they don't break. Okay, okay. Oh my god, you sonker. Sounds like a wet fart when it dies. Yeah, I don't think I have it yet. Magnet of Geos, okay, they, they just come to you? Okay, I entered the crossroads from down there. Well, it has corpse retrieval, it doesn't have any kind of stamina, so I wouldn't call it souls, but it has some elements. Mm. Ronic, it is really good. Really, really good. A really solid controls. Art direction, music's fantastic. It has this cutesy look, but you can see the dark undertones of death, decay, 
uh, you know, days of glory gone. No, 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 no. Souls like is a sub-genre in itself that incorporates some elements of other genres, but mostly brings stuff of its own. How should I put it, man? Opening a shortcut doesn't make, make it Metroidvania. If opening a shortcut, a shortcut made something Metroidvania, all Resident Evil games of, of old would be Metroidvanias. Like, you have to draw the line somewhere, you know? I don't sleep these days. Fucking tired. Mm. I want to go to the town and take the the train. Yeah, it has very relaxing music, that's true. There is a charm shop. Oh, thanks so much, Frank. Thank you for supporting it, brother. Oh, we can go here and uh, we freed a few. One fourth of another mask, I suppose. Yeah, we had 90 people earlier, man. I got raided. It was nice. That daft old fellow over there, he keeps talking absolute drivel. Seems to think the very air is deadly down in the caverns. Perhaps he should consider not breathing. <laughs> he keeps talking about dreams too. <laughs> dreams are more for those too feeble to truly live. <sighs> Papa Nada. Well, there's nothing here. Is there something else that I can purchase from the town? Yeah, yeah, I know, I know, I know. I bought everything. I can start. I bought everything she had to sell.
Well, she's not there yet. Don't think she is. Down afterwards? What are you talking about? Okay, Fog Canyon, we have to find the guy who sells the map. We're going blind. Who the F are you? Oh, Bakura Finello. Bakura Finello? Hello there, dearie. Was about to close up shop and run till you came along. I provide a banking service if you're interested. Losing one's geo is a terrible thing and it's not much more likely that you carry it about yourself. My vault is much more secure. In all my time as a banker, I've never lost a single geo. Maybe you'd consider opening an account? Not now. Bada, bada. I understand. It's difficult to part with hard one geo. I'll be here if you change your mind. I just want the map. Give me the map, guys. Bro, I was, I was behind the fucking stone slab. Bunnies, are you sure? I could hear him, man. I could hear him whistling. They're Hanar. Okay, here we are. <laughs> Badassedly. You're speaking in riddles. I have no idea. It's my first playthrough. How do you go? How do I go there? Hmm. 
Right at the Queen Station. Jump for fuck's sake, why is this happening? Click that. Okay, we need that. I suppose we need the train station to reach it. If you attack from above, they don't even notice you're attacking them until it's too late. That's interesting. Avalanche Talem, Adrefe. Good night. Okay, so we're gonna go to Dirtmouth and we're gonna take the train to the Queen Station.
Hey Steph, very nicely my man, very nicely. Tonight's great. If I wasn't so tired, it'd be perfect. Wait. Oh my god. Oh, I didn't click that. What is up? Okay, I'm at the Queen Station, guys. I don't have a map. And I cannot go from the right because the right has this freaking fungus. So right is off. This is a metal gate. Cannot get past it. Okay, fungal waste. Fucking bulbo shit. What sign, guys? What sign? Oh, here. Oh, I can hear him. Nice. Oh, my short friend, you've caught me at the perfect time. I'm just about finished charting these noxious caverns. Very territorial types make their homes within this area. I'd suggest avoiding them when possible. Further below, some strange thing creatures gave me quite a scare. They seemed an intelligent bunch. In my youth I'd have braved their caves, but I fear my matured physique wouldn't be able to outrun them were they to turn violent. There's a potent odor about these caverns and far worse for me, I suspect. My trunk is quite sensitive, whereas you don't seem to process a scent organ of any kind. Is that you cannot smell at all? Oh, sweetie, you're done? Oh. Come on guys, let's hit a hundred likes. Yep.
Welcome to. Okay, this isn't happening. This isn't happening either. I came from here. I'm hearing gibbering since Cleop petting the poodle talking in tongues oh, 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 oh. Dimitris thank you for the companies my man hello poodle <laughs> Show them. Show them the beast. We should make a game about the poodle, man. <laughs> glob, glob, gub, glob. City on the right of the map. Where is the city on the right of the map? I cannot progress to the right because we have a locked door. Big statue to the right. Okay, I have it opened on the map. I did I already explore it? Impossible. Hmm? No. Baby, go so she doesn't take a shit in the place. Go, go. Come on. Well, there's no way of approaching it from down there at the moment. Let's try this path. Okay, we opened this. No, this is not the path, the other one. Yep. I got it, cube.
One more like for a hundred. Let's do it. Is this it? Yeah, this is supposed to be... But dude, there is no fucking bridge. I was here. <sighs> Up how? There's nothing. Double jump? Do I have to get another ability? Maybe from below? is this Pray for mercy, Mandis. Wonder seeking death, welcome. May you find shift end upon our close. Yes. 
there's no way I'm going that way. I'm gonna get stuck and then I'm gonna lose my mind. 100 likes. Thank you, peeps. this one Das Master of me coming in here. Bro, fuck me. I'm tired and I'm getting fucking pissed. I'm gonna lose my shit. I'm gonna totally lose my shit now. Okay, what is all this? Dust Master. There's the likeness of an eccentric bug road as the Dust Master. The bear will be able to dust more often as well as dust downwards. Perfect for those who want to move around as quick as possible. Senses the pain of its bearer and lashes out of the world around them. When taking damage, Sprout Thorny Vines are damaged nearby foes. Protects its bearer with a shard shell that focuses on its soul. The shell is not destructible and will shatter if it absorbs too much damage. Okay. At least we can add this. Don't worry, Frank. I'm gonna shut it down because I'm very tired as well. Uh, so, people, I'm gonna leave it here. If you enjoyed this, hit me up on Discord. Let me know that you wanna watch more. And we'll make it happen. So grateful for the generosity tonight. Thank you so much for your presence here. I hope you liked what you saw. Had a nice surprise, pretty eventful stream, and uh, I'll see you again on Sunday. If you want to support the channel, please consider Patreon, the Buy Me A Coffee platform, direct PayPal, you can get a membership here or sub subscribe on Twitch, every little bit helps. Until next time, be well, stay frosty and always travel perfection. Cheers.